Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. A block of mass 2 kg is placed on a trolley of mass 5 kg. Moving horizontally, a force of 8 Newton is applied on the block which slides on the surface of the trolley. The frictional force between the trolley and the ground is zero. So wherever you see these kind of tires there, uh, always understand that the examiner is trying to convey that there is no friction between the two surfaces. Okay, the trolley accelerates at the at the acceleration of one meter per second square. So the acceleration of the trolley is given, although the force is applied on the block, not on the trolley. What is the coefficient of dynamic friction between the block and the trolley? Now it is given that the block and the trolley are also having a relative motion. Do you see this? Okay, it slides this. So my students, I believe that um, before this uh, question, IB has asked you similar kind of questions, but the relative motion between the block and uh, the trolley were not considered at that time. So in this question, like in this year, they have increased their level, I can say, like at, at least the level of the question now. So now they're talking about the relative motion between the block and the trolley. So this is a new thing. So you have to be very careful about this. Now, what are we going to do this? You try to understand the force is actually applied on the block, not on the trolley. So why the trolley is accelerating? Obviously, when you are pulling the block, there is an there is a friction there. So this is the friction force which is acting on the block in the backward side. But the same friction is creating an action reaction pair which is acting on the trolley. So the friction of the same magnet uh, magnitude which was which is acting against the block is facilitating the motion of the trolley. Now it is said that the acceleration of this is 1 meter per second square and the mass of the trolley is uh, 5 kgs. So I can say that the force experienced by the trolley should be 5 Newton. So 5 Newton will be the friction because friction is the only force which is trying to drag uh, the trolley towards right hand side. So friction magnitude is 5. So now I'm going for finding the friction. So that will be mu into n or if you call it r then mu into r the normal reaction. So friction is 5 mu is unknown. Reaction is the weight of this body and the mass is given as 2 kg. So this is mg the weight and that is producing a normal reaction that will be given by 2 g or 20. So we can just take it as 20 here uh, if you take g as 10. So 5 fours are 20 clearly the mu is coming out to be 1 by 4. So mu is 0 0.25 and yes, the answer is C for this question. So this is how we do this question and I hope things will be very clear to you. If you people are facing some problem even now, please mention that in the comment section. All the best. Bye.